Hello everybody! Hope everyone's doing well. Sorry for the slight delay in getting started. Might be a slightly shorter stream tonight. Uh, but I said that last time, didn't I? But it might actually be the same. Uh, hope everyone's doing well. Let's go. No idea what to do. Hello, Arlen, Redinar, Redinator, and Blue Handed. Hey, uh, what am I doing today? Hmm. Sniggles, hello. Good morning. Hmm. A conditioned response indicating fear of reprisal. There's no obvious symptom like you're important. In my experience, psychopaths really show the least sign of any inner change or development. Wolfe's pilum mutat and then mores, as they say. The leopard never changes his spots. Myth castles, hello. Can I draw Godzilla? I don't know, I said. I think you mentioned that last time. I'm not a free Godzilla fan. I mean, I don't mind the movies. Um, but design wise, it's like. Eh. I was gonna draw Godzilla, I just draw a dinosaur. Uh, I am drinking a, it's a Kona something, kind of brewing something or other. Wanna, passed away, thank you. My wife poured it for me, so I didn't know. And it's, I'm drinking it out of a mammoth brewing cup. So, um, very good. One of those things you should... They have the, the Kona, you can get the Kona like 24 pack mix uh, variety pack at Costco, so I do that a lot. Well, when I need beer, not necessarily a lot. around uh, very closely at the moment um, since we are so well in the midst of potty training potty training is the one well early in the stages of uh, I think it's some sort of Mermaid type thing. Tonight. I think I'll do a little bit more line work based in the last thing I eat tonight. Because oh. it's been a while since I've done that. Ace Hornets, Bensky the Champ, hello.
Yes. Mermaids, yes. I'm not sure I have traditional or not just yet. Puppies sniffing at everything. Uh, also, um, let me know if the audio levels are off. I didn't, didn't check anything before I went. I don't think I've changed um, any settings, so it should be okay, but you know, it should have been weird. Uh, is that a corgi? No. She, she looked more like a corgi. Uh, when we first got her a couple of weeks ago, she's a uh, she's a Melanie puppy, just a baby. Uh, she's gonna be 11 weeks old on Monday, so still little, a puppy. And if you follow me on Instagram, you'll see. All of her exploits. Uh, music might be louder than me. Maybe that's just because I'm not talking loudly enough. I can turn it down a little bit. <laughs> yes, her legs are actually a lot longer than they were when we, we first picked her up. She had super, super stumpy uh, puppy legs when we got her. Um, she actually had to have surgery last week on Friday, uh, so almost a week ago now. And when they put the cone on her, she, at the time, she couldn't reach her paws to chew on them. But since then, so in less than a week, she can now chew on her paws through the size of the cone. So I think it's partly she's just gotten bigger, and partly her legs specifically have gotten a lot longer than they were when we first picked her up. She looks so much like a corgi. I feel like it would be pretty cute to me. So... Insurance thing. You okay? Don't do that.
Your friend had one? Yes. Um, yeah, they're gonna be... She's gonna be enormous. Luckily, the, um, the girls don't get quite as big as the guys, but yeah, she's gonna be pretty huge and fluffy. Yeah. That's not gonna work. Sharing drawings, what do I prefer? Instagram or Tumblr? Um, I mean, Tumblr's better for looking at stuff. Um, I think. Instagram is sort of easier to... Is, Instagram is easier to post to. So obviously you can share from Instagram to Tumblr. So I guess that's the... Instagram can be really frustrating because you don't... Um, can never zoom in on anything, but I, I still quite like the and it, like the more people you follow on it. I mean, it's the same thing on Tumblr, right? The more people you follow on it, the more of a pain it is to keep up with. But that's just anything. Like the more people you follow, the more likely you are to like miss something. Um, and it was funny, everyone was up in arms about the, like, the changes Instagram made to, um, their algor like, algorithms so that you'd see things in a bit of a different order. Um, and I can see that why it might be frustrating, I mean, even for me, probably, um, but it's actually, I found it really helpful because it means I actually, like, because I follow a lot of people that I'm like, eh, it's like, I don't use it for news, I use it for just looking at stuff that is sort of cool, and then I follow, so I follow a whole bunch, bunch of artists and things, and then obviously like family and stuff, and so it's, so far with the new system, it seems like the family stuff is just closer to the top. So I don't miss photos anymore. That's sort of nice. I don't know. But it's a bit of a catch-22 because you, someone has to like regularly like your stuff to be regularly getting informed about it. But if they if you're not, if you're missing it a lot, then they're never gonna start doing that, right? I don't know. Um, well, hold on. Hello, and Athena Wallace. Hello. Um, honestly, I never started posting to Tumblr, just because it and added another one, another thing to keep track of, putting art up on, and I'm bad enough at, um, bad enough at doing that already. Am I using a charcoal brush? No, I'm using this the same brush that I use for everything. Um, it does just look that way a little bit because of the, the soft edge. Um, honestly, I should probably try and like play around with finding a, a nice brush for doing line work or for like sketching in. I haven't really gotten found one of them like, oh yeah, this is this is nice to use. So I'm just like, eh, I just use the standard what I use for everything else.
Kujimbe! Hello! Good to see you. Cannon, hello. I have to save. Um, I, look, there's not, I find something so satisfying about um, defining the like curves of a snake or something with this sort of. Um, this sort of like lumpy knobs. Um, they're so good for uh, showing the curve um, and like twist of a shape like that. Like crocodiles or dinosaurs, especially or dragons. Like having them sort of pop up and then wrap around and sort of disappear around the back of a, um, around the back of a, like a fold or a curve. Internet famous. The cats are doing okay with the puppy. And it's actually surprising. So the, the smaller, more skittish. The smaller, more skittish uh, cat is actually doing considerably better than, um, than the bigger boy cat, who we thought was the would be like the alpha kitty. Because um, uh, she's a lot more uh, likely to just hiss at it, hiss at the puppy. If the puppy just like runs up, she just hisses at him, hisses at her, and then like bats her in the face, and she's like, Bleh. but the other cat for some reason he's just super laid back. So he, if she runs up to him and starts like chewing at his fur, he's just like. Just, he just doesn't do anything. Um, so, yeah. But I think they're getting used to each other.
Surely she kind of done something else. Stop it! Why are you sniffing? Stop. Leave the electrical cord alone. You are about to get out of here. Sorry, stream people. <laughs> it is fine. Uh -huh. Help. Surely she's gonna fall asleep at some point, right? No, only when you're done streaming. And then she'll be fine. Alright, I'm gonna try not to spend too much too long uh, rendering or uh, lining out these brain carl things. Wow. Oh, that's a cone. Oh, but there's two cards. I don't think that counts as a mermaid any Oh, wait, did, does anyone... Charlie, did you see, um... Uh... Tiffany Turrell... Um... Did some... She know how to be an Ah. Uh, she did some pug um, mermaids, which are pretty wonderful. I believe, if I can find them. She also, also does amazing dinosaurs. Anyway, look it up. Um, they're pretty great. God damn it. That's not how that goes. Jalapeno Jack, hello. Uh, and Mer, the Mer Pugs, uh, Tiffany Turrell. Um, I can't find it for now. But Gun Hui, hello. I couldn't find the picture. It's probably on Facebook somewhere, but they're pretty amazing.
I wonder what fish a corgi would be if it had to be a mermaid. What type of fish would would they turn into? Or would the lower half be if it was a corgi? Black Bramble, hello. And Lionfish uh, inspired? Yes, definitely. Uh, they're so cool. Um, even if they're bastards. Uh, we went diving on our honeymoon, actually. We went diving in St. Lucia in the Caribbean. And there's so many of them around. They're, they're pests. Uh, which is such a shame, but they're so pretty. Yeah, they're an invasive species almost everywhere, it seems. They proliferate uh, super quickly. Except where they're supposed to be, obviously. Uh, we were in the, um, at the Great Barrier Reef at Christmas time, too, um, which is where they should be. Um, but we didn't see any there. But yeah, it was crazy how many there were in St. Lucia. Not often that pests are quite so uh, striking and pretty looking. I feel like I should be doing a better job of keeping track which side of the, um, which like rotation of the body these quills are all coming off.
Is there any trick to getting smooth lines in Photoshop? Um, there is, there's something called, shit, what is it? Lazy and Izumi that I know a bunch of people talked about, I've heard. Um, I have not used it. It's honestly, for me, it's just been practice. Uh, and, not, and I still don't think, like, my, my curves in Photoshop don't feel uh, quite as nice as they do in other, like, my, my comparison is always Sketchbook Pro, and, like, the curves in, in Photoshop just never feel, uh, as nice as they do there. Um. Uh, I think working a little further zoomed out can help, um, you've got to, you, you probably will have to, like, undo a little bit more to get exactly what you want. But I find uh, you often get will get like a smoother line with a smaller like curve of your wrist, whereas if you have to like traverse more of the screen, you end up um, you end up sort of uh, jiggling a little too much. Aiden Peanut Head, hello. Uh, and what tablet am I using? Super old, on two of three. Uh, I have a Cintiq at work, and I have a companion at home as well that I use, but not. It's a bit difficult to stream from. At some point, I'll probably get a. Um, I'll probably get a Cintiq at home, but honestly, that uh, Intuos does pretty well. What's that? Oh, you found it. Nice. For those who want to see, oh, it wasn't Tiffany. It was Bryn Cos. That would explain it. Bryn Metheny. Um, that would explain it. There you go. Someone knew what I was talking about. But yeah, pretty amazing. <laughs> pretty good. Check her out. She's pretty awesome. <laughs> Thank you, Arlen, for 
finding that. Remolly kick. Hello. Now I feel really bad getting them mixed up. This is a very low helicopter. I don't know if you can hear that. I presume you can. Fenris, good to see you, sir. Have work tomorrow, yay! Pack for a flight instead. Oh, man, I have gotten. I used to be like a couple days before I got everything ready for a trip. I've gotten so like lax. I'm like, yep, all right, we're leaving in a couple of hours. Should probably get the suitcase back that. So I will admit. Monica does a lot of the packing these days, but even she's gotten, well it's not lazy, but it's like, yep, yeah, alright, not not long till the flight go, get less, less stressed, as you do, as you travel more. Thanks man! Yeah, I thought it'd be interesting to do something a bit more line work oriented maybe. I'll probably slap some colors on it at the end, but we'll see if I've got time. Or if I spend the entire time trying to work out some green coral. Exactly, efficient. You don't need to spend ages, like, days before you're traveling. Oh. I wonder, um, my old housemate's uh, mom apparently used to, she he's from England, so she'd come and visit. Um, uh, occasionally when you're in the US. Um, Apparently, she would pack weeks in advance, which just seems crazy. But she's come to the U.S. quite a few times now. I wonder if she's gotten more efficient at that. I don't know. It's not a bad thing. Everyone has ways of dealing with the stress and making sure they don't forget anything or whatever. I can tell these faces are going to be a pain. Oh look, and I ignored the hands too.
Mr. Creep, thank you very much. Since I'm drawing mermaids, do I have any advice for lighting an underwater scene? <sighs> well, you'll notice that I am drawing and not painting this. Um, no, but... Um, your lighting is often gonna be a lot... Oh, I thought the stream was yesterday. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, no. Well, I'm glad you made it today. Uh, I'm sorry about that. Um, uh, anyway, underwater scene. Um, hmm, I haven't done a lot, so... I think one of the things to, to pay attention to is the way uh, you get shafts of light like a lot more obviously. Um, just because there's more stuff in the water, um, and so you get the caustics on things that are in the water, and everything, all the shadows are sort of a little softer, or like depth, um, is a little thicker. Yujimbe, see ya! Glad you could make it briefly. Uh, you watched the last week's video and did you see a Britzel t-shirt? You did! I did get his, uh, his, uh, what was it, US Forum, um, Legion, Legion shirt. It's super cool. It's getting a little, getting a little old, unfortunately, now. Um, but yeah. It's a very cool design, that one. I haven't seen much of his stuff lately. I don't know if he's been posting on DeviantArt. No, I haven't been going to the forum very much anymore. Makes me sad. Was that a beer? Yes. It is a beer. Oh, now that I'm halfway through this, I wish one of them was like an angelfish mermaid. Maybe I'll do that. 
that later. I'll do some, actually do something for my Patreon. James, good to see you, man. Thank you. <laughs> it's interesting because a lot of other fish, like a lionfish or something, you can sort of stretch out and make sort of snaky, but angelfish is just like. What? It'd be an interesting. Interesting. Glad you could catch a stream. Loved your stream the other day, man. Always cool to catch. When spring mess is on me, I want to meet you with the greatest money from the branches trigger star. Hear my soul grows till it smashes above the sea. The bell Hope you've been having a good time. I wish I could save an angle like that in Photoshop. Um, I mean, it's not a huge deal here, but being able to snap back to like that same, it's not quite the same, to so that same angle would be so nice. Thank you very much. It's funny how easily something like this sometimes happens. Like, if I'm. 
The difference between doing just something that's sort of stream of consciousness and actually doing uh, doing like work that is you need to draw this, we need it like, this particular way is so surprisingly different. Like this is like, hey, what am I gonna do? And it's so complicated, there's like sweet shapes. Ran right about a background as I go. Like, what the hell? Ugh, in his face. I had to go and go talking about how easy it was feeling, didn't I? Did I see Warcraft yet? Yes, we went last night. Um, we had Blizzard rented out the local um, the local cinema and had basically every theater playing it. Um, I enjoyed it. I it's funny. I don't know how much of that is because like whether my bar was lowered because of the reviews that I had heard. Um, I mean, I think I would have liked it. I don't think it changed it too much. Yeah, it's Spectrum. It just had the entire thing booked out. Um, I think there was a lot of stuff that played on Nostalgia. And I haven't even played. Like, I don't think I ever actually played. Um... Like the original Warcraft, so I don't know exactly that like storyline. Um, I played War like Warcraft Three was basically my only 
and I played that a bunch. Like I played Warcraft three a heap of times, but that was my Warcraft knowledge. Like I never really played. I played a, I got a character to eighty, seventy with my wife, with then girlfriend, uh, now wife. Um, but I haven't played a lot of WoW. But like knowing, a, like quite a lot about it. Um, at least like knowing the setup makes such a big difference. I think because going in. Going in blind um, would be would be weird. I th honestly I don't know. Like they didn't. I think it starts off very fan servicey. They get out of the like. Um, Here's Stormwind. Here's like Goldshire. This is your Karazhan. Like here's all these places you've heard of. Um, but once they've like gone through that. The pace is pretty cool, like, yeah, I don't know, I'm not gonna spoil anything, I would definitely, I mean, it's, of course it's fan service, it's, it's a movie made by a guy who really likes Warcraft, and it's produced by, like, a bunch of people from Blizzard worked on it as well, and, like, it's, it's, how is it not gonna be fan service? But, I mean, that's like saying Game of Thrones is fan service, right, like, to some degree, um, like, I mean, I mean, a lot of people haven't read the books at this point, I'm sure. It's a lot bigger than that. But at the same time, it's like anything that's based on something else to some degree is fan service, right? But yeah, I mean, critics hated it. Yeah, I mean, it's a movie like that. And critics aren't going to get, like, it's, it's tough. Because if you spent too long, like, elaborating the world for people who didn't know about it, it would suck. Like, that would be terrible. I mean, obviously it has flaws, whatever. Like, but yeah, no, I, I definitely enjoyed it. Alright, I'm going to take a quick break. Um, maybe refill my drink. And come back and finish this off. I don't know if I'll get too much color done on it. Um, so tonight, maybe just a flat wash or something and some shadows. But back in a few minutes. I stole this from you, by the way, James. Seems like a better way of doing it than just at least people get to look at something interesting. 